Jerry Work with Word Media in Nashville, Tennessee. In this video, we are going to introduce you to Google's AdWords Editor tool, which can save you hours of time managing your Google AdWords accounts. The first thing you have to do is download AdWords Editor to your hard drive. AdWords Editor is a client-side program, meaning it runs on your hard drive rather than in your browser. Click the Tools link on the Campaign Management menu. On the next screen, click the Download AdWords Editor button. And on the next screen after that, click the down Download AdWords Editor button again. The first thing you have to do when you run the program is select your account. So go to the File menu and select Open Account. I already have a number of accounts listed that I've already set up. The first time you use the program, you need to click the Add Account button to add your account. Just type the email address and password associated with your AdWords account and click OK. The very first thing you need to do every time you work on your account is click the Get Recent Changes button. You have the option of doing a basic request or a re request that includes minimum cost per click bids. Basic is probably fine for you. You may be asked to provide your login information again. Getting recent changes will make sure that you are working on the very latest version of your account and not overwriting work that someone has already done. It is a good idea to always do this even if you are the only person working on the account. This will prevent you from accidentally undoing any work you may have done directly in the Google AdWords interface. The AdWords editor interface is much different than Google's online interface. It has a sparse spreadsheet-like appearance, but that's really the point. Rather than walking you through things step by step, you can make changes very quickly. At the top of the middle section are a number of tabs. Keywords let you work on your keywords. Placements let you modify your placements. Negatives let you work on your negative keywords. Ads let you add or modify ads. Ad groups let you make changes to your ad group settings. And campaigns let you modify your campaign settings. One of the most powerful features of AdWords Editor is that it lets you copy and paste objects, even entire campaigns. To make a copy of a campaign, right-click on the campaign name on the right-hand side of the screen and select Copy. Then click on the account and right-click and paste. Now, it really doesn't do you any good to run the exact same campaign, but the advantage of copying a campaign is that you can then go in and make minor changes to the copied campaign without having to set everything up from scratch. One example is if you want to run almost the same campaign in two different markets. You can just make a copy of the first campaign and then change the target market for the second campaign. And you can go in and make whatever other changes are necessary to customize the second campaign for the new market. There are a lot of very cool features that we will discuss in future videos. But just to give you a preview, on the Keywords tab, the Replace Text link lets you easily replace text in your keywords. Going back to our, our earlier example, say you copy a campaign and change its geographic market. Odds are you also have geographically targeted keywords that will also need to be changed. For instance, this campaign has lots of keywords that contain the word Nashville. But say I wanted to change the word Nashville to Memphis or Atlanta or whatever. Using this feature, it's very easy. This saves a ton of time over having to change those keywords manually. Thanks for watching this short video on AdWords Editor. To learn more about pay-per-click marketing, check out our new book, Scientific Search Engine Marketing, available on Amazon.com or WorkMedia.net. Thanks.